Welcome back to Adventures with Edna. I'm Chris. I'm Chance. And today we're headed to Chesney, South Carolina, where we're going to check out the Bantam Chef, which is a really popular uh, drive-in restaurant with a Studebaker on the front of the building. So we're headed to check that out, see how that is. So come on along for the ride. Chesney, so we're just kind of looking for the restaurant now. I know it's somewhere up here on the left. You getting hungry, Chance? What are you gonna eat? I don't know, I've never been there. I don't know what they have. It's like an old diner. They probably got like burgers and other stuff. I bet they got coleslaw. I know how much you love coleslaw. I am not like coleslaw. No fish. It's okay, I don't like fish either. You think Kaylin's gonna be jealous that we went without her? I don't care. <laughs> That's not very nice. I'm still cooler than her. You're cooler than Kaylin? Who the heck is Kaylin? It's really kind of a pretty drive out here. Street tacos. We started having a bit of a technical issue on this drive where the shifter keeps getting jammed halfway out of third, so it's like you're in neutral, only you're not in neutral, which isn't cool. Oh, I see it. We're almost there. I see the sign. I saw it first. No, you didn't. I saw it first. I saw it first. I saw it first. I've seen it this entire drive. No, you didn't see it at all. My, that's why my eyes are better than yours, because no, I eat more carrots. Uh, I can see it further. Look at that big helicopter. Where? Right there. See, look at the giant helicopter. Whoa, look how big that is. Um... We'll have to stop and check that out on the way back. It says we're nine tenths of a mile from the restaurant. What's that mean? It means we're almost a mile from the restaurant. McDonald's, Pizza Hut. I don't think we're going there. We can drive all this way just to go to McDonald's or Pizza Hut. Where are you, Phantom? The Chesney Washerette. Oh, I see the sign. You weren't even looking. Who cares? I already saw it. That car. You 
see that big boy right there? Mm-hmm. I've seen that. They got a big boy. I've seen that. All right, we made it here to the Bantam Chef. Looks pretty cool so far. I mean, what's not cool about a Studebaker, a Studebaker hanging out the front of the building? Plus, there's another one sitting over there that looks pretty cool, so we'll have to check that out, too. Elvis, a real person? Yeah, Elvis Presley. What does he do? What's he famous for? This guy definitely has to thank the Studebakers. Dad, what's Elvis famous for? Did you just... Did you just say what El what's Elvis famous for? Yeah. You don't know who Elvis is? I know who he like, is because there's like a boobies on him. Here, what? put your arm around her like you're like she's your girlfriend. Oh. Hey, yup. Is that cool? Look at all the cars in this little cabinet down here. What's Elvis famous for? Dad, what's Elvis famous for? He's a singer. Oh, how Forrest Gump taught him how to dance. Real Forrest Gump. What has Elvis been singing? Um, he sang for a long time, and then he passed away in the 70s. He died on the toilet. He died on the toilet? Yeah. Are you serious? Yeah. How? I don't know. Why? I don't know. GT40 in there. They got new Bugattis in there? I think they're all old cars. No, they're not. Look, there's a BMW that looks new right there in Trey. Yeah, that's true. There's another Studebaker right there. There are two of them. See, it's right there. That's new. The BMW right there is new. I think they got an Edna in there. Look, they got a they got an F one hundred in there. I like the GT forty. I like that. This one. You like that one? Because mm -hmm. it was one of the first cars. <laughs> so, do you think that woman is driving the car? I want to get in there. It looks so fun. Yeah, they got a horse drawn carriage in there. It looks so creepy. It looks creepy? I like that plane. That looks cool. Where? Oh. Look, hanging from the ceiling. Look at this BMW. That's a BMW? Yep. It's called an Isetta. Why does it look so weird? It's got a flat tire on this one. Dad, why That's does it... That's what Steve Urkel used to drive. What's Steve Urkel? Who's Steve Urkel? He was from a show called Family Matters. He was like a nerdy guy. That's the worst BMW on the planet. <laughs> You were looking at a 1950 Studebaker Starlight Coupe. This I didn't is know what's one of the most unique cars that Studebaker ever produced. This is a champion model with a 100 horsepower, six cylinder, with hill holder, self adjusting brakes, and overdrive transmission. It gets 31 miles per gallon. Is that a drink? Is that a drink on that cup thingy? Yeah. Are those real people in the car? Dad, are those real people in the car? No, they're just dummies. Dad, let's look back here. That's our seat. Look. Statue of Liberty. Look! I've always wanted one of those. Yeah? Yeah. They like unfold. Do you have a dollar? Maybe. 
getting one. Ooh, I could get the. We only got 10 more seconds. <gasps> no! ah, you were so close. I thought I actually got it. Yeah, you had. Maybe I'll, maybe I'll get it if I hold it. No! <gasps> oh, man. Almost. <laughs> you look like a mad little kid. <laughs> Go with me. <laughs> Are you excited about your food? I don't know. You don't know? Am I going to get a car box? I asked for one. You think I'll get it? Yeah. You think or you know? Probably, she said she would. Yeah, but she didn't like say it like she didn't say it like she mean it. <laughs> she didn't say it like she meant it. So thirsty. Thirsty. Right here? It's a big burger. A big what? Burger. My burger's bigger than your burger. Well you said a small and a a large. Number seventy seven. The woman on the microphone is kinda of scary. Who? Why? I don't know. She looks scary. She just seems like you wouldn't want to make her mad. What do you think? Is it good? I like it. Well, Joel, what did you think of your lunch? Good. It's good? What was your favorite part? Um, I don't know. You don't know? It's not the car box? Show them the car box. <laughs> well, that Bantam Chef turned out to be pretty good. Uh, we got uh, we both got uh, bacon cheeseburgers, which were pretty good. Um, uh, pretty cool atmosphere in here, and pretty busy in here, especially being on a Sunday after church. Um, but we had a good lunch, and now we're going to go check out this helicopter that we saw up the street on the way over here. Uh, so let's go check it out. been riding on it. Here, pose with it. Are pose these, with it. Are those guns? Yeah. Some kind of rocket launchers or something. Could this hold my weight? I wouldn't try to get on it. Is this where you get in? Must be. I want to get in it. Dad, I want to get in it. Dad! Look! Some serious exhaust. Open, go down. Dad? Oh, here's another gun down here.
they glued it shut. It's a torpedo or something. Look how big this is. How does this even fit in the helicopter? I don't think that goes in the helicopter. I think that's like a torpedo or something. What, do they put those in like the war? What's this? I don't know. Maybe that's a bomb. This is a bomb? Maybe. I don't know. That's a bomb? Maybe. That is huge. Well, that seems like a pretty cool place to uh, end this video. Uh, we're going to head back home. Uh, we're having a ambulance come up the road. We're having a little bit of trouble with the uh, transmission at the moment. For some reason, it's stuck in third, so I'm going to have to go home and pull the shift tower off and see if I can figure out what's wrong. Uh, anyway, uh, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. We hope everybody enjoyed this video, and we'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching Adventures with Edna.